Hi, this video will show you how to estimate the maximum percentage error, which is the difference between approximate and exact values as a percentage of the exact value. Example 18. The radius of a right circular cylinder is measured with an error of at most 2% and the height is measured with an error of at most 4%. Approximate the maximum percentage error in the volume. Here a picture of a right circular cylinder is shown height h radius r. We know the volume of a right circular cylinder is equal to V equal to pi r square h. So V is a function depend on r and h. And to estimate the percentage error, let's look at the error term first. Now, error to measure the volume is approximately equal to partial differentiation of V respect to R times small error in R plus partial differentiation of V respect to H times small error in H. Therefore, if you do partial differentiation, take note of that partial differentiation of V with respect to R is 2 pi R times H and partial differentiation of V with respect to H is pi R squared. Therefore, we know that the error in V is approximately equal to 2 pi R H times small error in R plus pi R square times small error in H after I substituting this partial differentiation with respect to R as 2 pi R H and partial differentiation with respect to H as pi R square. Okay, that is a small error. If I want to find the percentage error of V, I must calculate error in V over the exact value of V, which means I must divide everything by V now. 2 pi RH divided by V times small error in R plus pi r square divided by v times small error in h. So let's do a calculation now. That means that percentage error of v, let me replace v by pi r square times h then times small error in R plus pi R square over V again is pi R square times H times small error in H. As we do that, we will see a lot of cancellation. First of all, pi R cancel with pi R, so you left with R, H, H cancel. And then pi r square and cancel with pi r square. Percentage error of v is equal to 2 times delta r over r plus delta h over h. Now we go back to the question. 
what is the percentage error of R and what is the percentage error of H? Looking at the question, we know that the maximum percentage error of radius is 2%. And the maximum percentage error of height is 4%. Therefore, we can say that the percentage error of R is less than 2%. And the percentage error of H is less than 4%. Therefore, the percentage error of V is less than 2 times 2% 2 plus 4%. By using the information, and we find out that percentage error now is at most 8%.